Hello, welcome back to the channel, and we've got, is it a hype beer? I know it was a few months back. This is Cronenberg 1664, and there's the cap. This is a Blanc, and yeah, there's been a lot of hype around this. I got this from Sainsbury's, seven pound for four bottles, but you get a nice little glass to go with it. Now Mrs B is going to really like the glass. I don't know if she's going to like the beer, don't know if I'm going to like the beer, but there's been loads of hype around it in the UK, uh, especially on like around beer tube in the UK. So let's get straight into it. Cronenberg, 330ml bottles, blue bottle, not a fan of the blue bottle whatsoever, I just don't like the look of that. So let's get it in there. It's like a wit, I think, style beer more than anything. Um, yeah, the, even the, the glass won't even fill. Well, doesn't fit even the bottle, but it looks like a. It looks all right to be honest in the glass. It looks quite well. What can I put? How can I say? It, um, draws you in. It looks like it's going to be a refreshing beer straight away. Nice little white, fluffy looking head. Looks all right in the glass. The glass is a bit dainty for me, um, but yeah. What percentage is this? What percentage is this? 5% ABV. Like I say, brewed in France. Um, don't know how much longer for, but it's brewed in France. And should be perfect for the summer weather, which it is at the moment. So let's get the wild well, look. Like I say, it looks like... If I was... If it, if it, you know, I didn't know what I was pouring, to go, oh, it looks like a nice little pale ale, that. You know, definitely got a haze through it. Um, feel nose blind there to be honest with you. What well, am I supposed to be picking up on the nose because I'm not really picking up much on the nose. I know it's not my nose. Very, very little, little, little amount of malt there. Tiny amount of an aroma. I think it is it classed as a, a wheat beer, whip beer. I don't know, but it's not a massive amount of aroma, which will probably, you know, for a lot of people, that's probably a good thing as well. Because some of the wheat beers, whip beers, have got quite powerful aromas. This is really, really tame on the aroma. Okay, so aroma, not a lot going on for me. Okay, cheers, everyone. Better than I was expecting. Taste wise, sweet malt. Sweet malt, there's definitely a fruitiness going on there, but it's not just like a, it's not a lemon fruit, it's a peachy, for me, a peachy note going on there. It's not unpleasant, it's an easy drink. You can imagine that going down really, really easy. Now I've broke that seal. And getting peach, like apricot and peach on the nose. It does taste fruity, it tastes fruited. I don't know how they've made this, but it tastes like they've put fruits in it. Um, I wouldn't say that's come from hops. I don't know where it's come from. It'd be interesting to see if it says anywhere. If it does say anything, I'll put it below. But it's got apricot notes going on for me. Apricot peach. Um, it's pleasant, 5% hidden. I drink that. Um, I'm not saying it's my favourite beer, but yeah, is it like an amazing? No, it's not amazing. It's just an easy drink, which you can just forget about and drink. Probably fantastic in the summer. I think Mrs. B's going to like that, which is great because I've got another three bottles, which Mrs. B could have in this glass. That's a winner for me. Um, yeah, nothing bad about it. It's just an okay beer. Yeah, it's not the best beer in the world. Nowhere near. The, the notes on it, it's like a, like a a caramel fruited sweet. That's all I can really get from that. So let me see. Does it say anything at all on the bottle from Cronenberg? Get the rest of that in there. It's decent enough, it's decent enough. Uh, brewed in France and bottled in the UK. So what did they do? Send tankers of it over and bottle it at Marston's Brewing in Wolverhampton by Carlsberg Brewery. 
Um, wheat, yeah, barley wheat, glucose syrup, aromatic caramel. There you go, there's a caramel. I was saying, I was getting just then, didn't I? I just said about a, um, like a, a fruited sweet, like a caramel. Aromatic caramel flavouring, hop extract, spices, not getting that. Orange peel, coriander, not getting them either, to be honest with you. Not like a you would on a normal wit beer, not for me. I'm getting this, um, honestly, apricot peach, you know. Um, yeah. Yeah. There you go. I think Mrs. B would buy that again. I don't think I'd have it for myself again, but Mrs. B would probably buy that. So there you go. It's holding a nice little fluffy head there, isn't it, now? See that? <coughs> holding it there. But, yeah, don't know what the whole hype, all the hype's about. It's an okay beer. It's not the best beer. It's not the worst beer. Just an okay beer. Okay. Cheers, everyone. I'll see you on another one.